16 fastest growing industries of the future. In the past few years, the global preferences for humanity has been changing at a rapid pace. With the new advancement and development of the technology, the industries have been shaped up and new era of industries are formed. So I'm going to run through the 16 fastest growing industries of the future. This is based on the research and a lot of paperwork I have concluded at this particular 16 industries. Please watch this video till the end so that you can download the mind map of the same. Also, please make a lot of notes and make your decision wisely to which industry you want to take your career or you want to invest your time and money into. So let's deep dive into the mind map and understand what are the 16 fastest growing industries of the future. The number one is internet as a thing. So internet, can you imagine 15 years back, the internet was used only in very, very few people had access to the internet. The data access was very, very vague. But today, this is not the scenario. Today, each and every villages in the remote places, people have access to the internet. Internet has become one of the major requirement in the day to day lives. We are in an era where internet has become routine. No matter what you are doing directly or indirectly, you are associated with internet, both indoor as well as outdoor. So the knowledge of software is gaining a never green momentum and it has become the highest scope in the coming days. Every industry requires internet to run their business. Without internet, there's, it's impossible to survive any business. So the next 15 industry, which I'm going to explain, is all again dependent on the internet. So internet has been evolved as one of the major requirement and without which we cannot do anything. The future of internet is the future of humanity. Everything is connected through internet. So the number two is robotics. So what is a robot? Robots are nothing but the humans made machine that exhibit the behavior of human and animal as per the program we feed. So today robots are helping in advanced medical surgeries to the doctors wherein the accuracy of surgery is such that there is no or there is zero accountability. The robots have in various manufacturing setup, they are lifting the heavy works to the humans where humans cannot interfere and where humans are not in a position to work on. There the robotics are playing a major role. Today, robots are semi-robotic in nature where most of the works are being performed by the robots. Even the household chores or household activity like sweeping and mopping, robots are helping. Just switch on the robots, they just clean, mop and your house is clean, neat and tidy. Can you imagine the robots being used in vast majority of industry? Whether it can be the banking as a customer service, a hotel to greet and take orders of the customer. Very soon the robots will be used in military and national disasters as well. Can you imagine robots being used in the military, a robot taking a gun and going and guarding the nation. Such wonderful and vast majority of robotic has the highest and the most preferred future in the coming days. So with that, so number three is the drones. Today, the drone is become a most or it is accessible to most of the people and it has got its own advantages in various sectors like military. Scientists today are working on small and tiny drones, especially which can be used for taking out data from the enemy soil. Military research has been very intense and drones are being prepared for attacks. Similarly, we, if we take about the supply chain management, in supply chain management, it is taking a new shape 
with the help of artificial intelligence today the amazon and other e-commerce industry are looking into the option of delivering lightweight goods with the help of drones disaster management so in disaster management where the floods take an aerial view of the flood hit zone or to locate where people are stranded and so on so drones are being majorly focusing on these particular industries cinema we all know that cinema in the past years whenever there used to be an aerial shooting they used to have a helicopter set up but today the same job drones are performing in terms of agriculture so agriculture it has got a very very vast application it has become the vast utilization and agriculture wherein the farmers can detect the overall vigor of the crops deficiency report and off late they are utilizing drones for various application of agricultural inputs such as pesticides insecticides fertilizers what not so drone are playing a very major role in agriculture as well today even in terms of enforcement agency where the traffic management traffic monitoring there also the drones are helping the cops also in catching the fugitives so drone has got the future and it is one of the major fastest growing industries so the number fourth is blockchain and crypto so crypto is the future of the currency as many countries have started regulating the cryptocurrency even in india the budget 2022 suggests that major emphasis were given to the cryptocurrency and a proper governing mechanism are put forth in place similarly in terms of federals other western countries where the crypto are playing or taking a major role of the future currency now similarly the the data is encrypted in the form of blockchain so the blockchain is the technology wherein the decentralized public ledger data are encrypted in blockchains and interconnected each other one of the highly secured way of storing data and encryption is blockchain today the blockchain have been utilized for cyber security banking firewalls data sciences national security and so on so blockchain has been one of the fastest growing along with the cryptocurrencies so the number 5 is health and fitness today the advance of medical research health and fitness has to improve the human's health through various mechanism health and fitness is the need of the heart with more and more people falling ill and sickness the fitness has gained lot of momentum and we can see lot of people hitting gym and other physical activities today in terms of pharmacy and drug sector scientists are conducting lot of research in terms of various drugs to induce healthy components to the humans and animals through dnas directly injecting it through the dnas today the consumption of food has led to various diseases like diabetic heart diseases high blood pressure and so on so in order to digest or in order to have fit and healthy physical activity is very very important and it is gaining lot of momentum mental fitness people are seeking mindfulness activity to keep themselves fit mentally because the current job sector the family pressure the peer pressure the official pressure all other external pressures are making humans mentally weak to be a very very strong in terms of mentally people are going towards mindfulness activity and it is taking lot of lot of people towards highly successful and more advancement in terms of their activity so the number 6 is data sciences so in data sciences we have big data for artificial intelligence machine learning essential for the future economy so big data almost every industry we mention is dependent on the data to make assessment and data is what artificial intelligence system learns from and increase the efficiency of our emotion economic decision and the country's global economic dependency is on big data similarly we have machine learning today the machine learning gives you the output based on various data which you feed into the system 
data is very much essential for the every economy of the country whoever is having data and can analyze the data properly will make impact to the healthcare the retail and what not political financial system and economic of the country so the number 7 what we have is the fintech so fintech is evolved into lot many advancement in terms of banking finance related activity today fintech is playing major role in developing economy in india especially more emphasis has been given towards the digital currency payment system very soon there will be a cashless economy there are a lot of advantages in terms of digital payment the one major such advantage is that it's eradication of corruption to some extent so the complete removal of physical currency and notes can lead to much better economy as per the recent survey and reports from various financial sectors so the banking and technology are evolving at a very very rapid pace digital payments people are going towards digital whether it can be both gold stock market anything for mat- for that matter everything is coming towards digital so eradication of physical currency and notes is going to take place very soon so the number 8 is stock market so we have people post pandemic or covid people are started investing in lot of lot of stock market investments with the advancement in e learning and due to the economic condition of the country many people are shifting towards in towards investing in stock market rather than traditional old saving methodolo- methodologies looking into the higher returns the compounding effect stock market is also emerging as the most and the number one preferred investment scenario for most of the people in india we have national stock market similarly in international we have for usa we have nasdaq for uk it is ftse and for japan it is nikkei so lot lot many people are preferring and going towards the stock market research and the stock market is shaping up very very rapidly so the number 9 is artificial intelligence we all know google and facebook they learn our algorithms they know they know our preferences they are studying our behaviors so today facebook and instagram knows and they interact as to how or what is the preferences what we are looking at today we interact with alexa siri and google and seek their advice and depend on first hand information there are houses which are completely automated with the help of artificial intelligence which can control the lighting system the water flowing system and in future most of the electronic systems will be controlled by the artificial intelligence today we have self driving cars the automated teller machines and we also work along with the robots there are devices devices which read books for us play music of the choice the field of arti- artificial intelligence will become one of the vibrant arena of the coming future the artificial intelligence is creating content for us wherein the humans are no need to use of brain to create the content the ai brain will start delivering all the required knowledge and content which will be way more powerful than our human brains such is the advancement and the kind of research which has been articulated in the artificial intelligence is immense and it is one of the fastest growing and it is going to be the future of humanity so number 10 is renewable energy so what is renewable energy today we all know that the fossil fuels is getting exhausted in exponential rate moreover the crisis like pandemic and war recently the russia invading ukraine 
is creating exorbitant increase in the fossil fuel price of the fossil fuel more and more countries are adopting towards electric vehicles again the source of energy can be captured from the solar lot of e charging hubs are being created across the places for charging the vehicles the photovoltaic solar capturing devices are being built the governments are especially encouraging people to have their own solar panels and they can depend on their own power for consumption similarly we have wind turbines also which is being used commercially to running the industries and for the supply of power to the grids of late now we can see hydrogen is also being one of the major source of renewable source of energy the big giants are investing on hydrogen energy and it is one of the future energy sources for the entire world making us less dependent on the fossil fuel so overall the renewable energy is also one of the fastest growing industries in the world next comes insurance insurance is one of the fast growing industry and is also a sunrise industry wherein it is also concerned with more and more people coming under the ambit of insurance post covid today the life is highly uncertain and insurance is the only must way of protection for the family members health insurance pre covid before the covid the health insurance was highly neglected and today many people have taken the covid as well as the health insurance very very seriously and it has become one of the need of the hour requirement there are other insurances as well like vehicle house fidelity insurance loan fire and peril industrial insurance similarly for travel air travel road and sector specific insurance are being developed next we have is e learning the covid has changed the formal education system the formal education system is getting completely outdated and people are opting for customized learning with more practical and focus based learning is being gained momentum at this hour customized learning has become a trend and today e learning is a 500 billion industry we have a lot of examples for customized learning wherein seeing is believing when you see how a particular system is working that makes sense you can retain the same in your mind rather than a mere memorization of the topic for example today the byjus who have created revolutionary in the education system for kids with more of video approach and practicality kids can able to learn they can visualize and keep more data in their mind because seeing is believing e-learning will be the primary means of education wherein people will just get enrolled in the required education and specific need for gain of the knowledge it is one of the primary means of learning in future coming to the number 13 it's e-commerce today we all know e-commerce has changed the way human used to purchase lot of shopping and other products amazon flipkart alibaba.com they have come in immense and they have invested millions of rupees in terms of setting up e-commerce today we need not go we need not step out of the house whatever is required is available with one simple press of a button that too within a minutes 10 minutes you get delivery of grocery you get delivery of medicines and what not fruits and vegetable whatever you seek you will get it in 10 minutes of time companies like amazon have created massive delivery movement in india hence the e-commerce is one of the big thing in the future constant research has been conducted to improve the delivery system and value addition to the customers so the e-commerce is going to play a major and vital role in the coming days so the number 14 is metaverse what is metaverse it is the space in the virtual reality reality wherein you will be performing your activity like a physical world can you imagine an alternate world has been created 
and you can do all the activity what you are doing in your physical world where the precise way of explaining is the mirror avatar of yours will be created and in the metaverse your avatar will be doing all the activity that you command to that this is the metaverse say for example you can buy a digital plot in the metaverse and on that plot you can set up your restaurant or a shopping mall or a complex or whatever the gaming feature console whatever it can be done metaverse and people whoever similar to your avatar they come in and purchase they come in and dine and they experience that they can experience that today the metaverse consists of two divisions one is virtual reality and the other one is augmented reality so what is virtual reality virtual reality helps in education wherein people are learning various complex structure through the virtual reality simulation activity you can drive the car combat training video games physical fitness and sports activity everything can be done in virtual reality you have to just wear the vr headset and start working towards your activity similarly we have augmented reality then the, the second part in the, the metaverse is the augmented reality the google maps your devices the phones are such that when you just click on a button you can find out a particular restaurant a shop or whatever that has become the augmented reality the supermarket real estate walk through malls you can shop sitting at home by wearing an augmented reality glasses so metaverse is the future and majority of big guns are investing billions of rupees in development of metaverse say for example facebook they themselves have announced meta version of facebook let's see what's going to happen about metaverse in the future so the number 15 is genomic and biotechnology as of now it's already a 20 billion industry in 2022 so the gene sequencing today genome and gene sequencing has been one of the most after sort industry the big guns like bill gates google are investing lots of lots of money into the genomic projects today we have to safeguard against cancer diabetic heart related diseases and this can be easily done by altering the genes of the human body nanotechnology which is again the sub industry in the gene and genomics and biotechnology so nanotechnology today is playing a vital role in the field of medicines to agriculture to super fast food and supplemental food for wellness in medicine the detection of cancer cell are and destruction of cancer cell similarly through the help of nanotechnology doctors are able to clear the blockage of heart ventricles thereby preventing cardiac arrest like this there are many such advantages in the field of nanotechnology wellness and supplemental food today the superfood are gaining lot of importance in terms of health and wellness conscious there are many supplemental food which helps in nano emulsifying absorption which is directly absorbed into the blood stream and can act against that particular disease in fraction of seconds this is the advantage of nanotechnology coming to coming to the agriculture sector which is one of the vast major field and lot of lot of research has been conducted in the field of agriculture with the help of nanotechnology there is one particular research have been conducted wherein with the help of nanotechnology the scientists are able to find out the crop diseases in advance through advanced genomic experiments we have a insect called fireflies which starts emitting lights through an enzymatic reaction in combination of nanotechnology where we are able to develop and inject nanobots to the plants wherein if there is any attack disease attack on the crops the crop starts emitting light indicating that something is wrong and needs your attention to take care of me that is a kind of research what we are talking about in nanotechnology especially in agriculture similarly the nanotechnology is used in biological warfare pandemic for both attack as well as to prevent them both has got 
its own advantages and disadvantages but overall gene modification and nanotechnology is going to be the future of the industry so the number 16 is direct selling or the network marketing this is one of the the most most development in the current scenario though there was a lockdown whole world was under lockdown but this was the only sector fmcg products direct selling products people made lots of millions of rupees by selling products in fmcg we have processed food ready to eat food and ready to cook food with more and more people losing job due to the pandemic and various economic factors of the country the globe today network marketing industry have gained lot of emphasis in terms of generating income directly and indirectly the network marketers are helping the consumers in delivering quality products and services as well we all require fmcg products for our day to day survival special wellness products whereas special wellness products are superfoods and other household items which are marked and delivered by so called network marketers are in full swing people today are giving more and more emphasis on organic and natural agricultural products for day to day consumption there are lot many industry which are focusing on delivering this kind of applicants for the growth of crops which are being developed directly to the farmers the network market is also a educating the farmers on modern method of farm cultivation and agriculture technology the network marketing or direct selling industry is surging towards exponential growth and every single day about 1 lakh plus prospect worldwide are looking for information to find the best opportunity available in the field of direct selling and network marketing not only employment opportunity few of them are looking for alternate source of income and this industry facilitates the same with an ample earning opportunity people have made their career out of it after entering the mlm business they could leave their 9 to 5 job and they are earning in millions bob proctor a famous motivational speaker says network marketing is nothing but creating your own economy it is possible only in this particular industry this is the only industry that teaches you on how you can lead your life and how you can nurture your team it is the business and which can make you create your own brand identity of your own and this will also answer many such questions like what is that you are really want how much you want to earn what kind of hours do you want to work how would you spend your day and many more there is one fact which i would like to emphasize here there are brilliant people who are consistently struggling financially while others who cannot read or write become millionaires can you resonate this this is the only industry that can facilitate what you want hi my name is kuldeep iregodu i am a serial entrepreneur and i am on a mission to help millions of people to achieve time and financial independence i would be emphasizing more about direct selling and network marketing industry and it is one of the fastest growing industry out of the 16 fastest growing industries so thank you for watching this video this is kuldeep iregodu signing off until we meet again thank you